three. Release your weight. The video just shown is the unsuccessful reenactment attempted by Scott's defense. The judge did not allow the jury to see it. The police doubted that someone would be able to dump a body out of Scott's boat. They theorized that Scott might have tied the boat to a buoy to stabilize it. They focused their searches underneath buoys and collected paint from a red buoy to see if it matched some of the red paint on the side of Scott's boat. Nothing was found in their extensive searches and the paint did not match. An engineer from the boat manufacturer testified that for Scott to dump a body out of this boat, there would have been close to 385 pounds at the edge of the boat. Scott weighed around 200 pounds. Lacey weighed 153 pounds, and the alleged four anchors weighed around 32 pounds. As shown in the video, the increase in weight at the edge of the boat resulted in the back right end of the boat sinking. There is no evidence that anchors could have weighed Lacey's body down. The prosecution alleged that Scott attached four anchors to Lacey's body, wrapped her in a tarp, and dumped her body out of his boat. The prosecution offered no scientific evidence in court as to whether or not this would be sufficient weight to submerge her body. This is probably because the San Francisco medical examiner told the police during their investigation that it was not likely that 30 pounds of weight would submerge 153 pounds, especially with the added buoyancy of a tarp. Not a single dog used in the case, a tracking dog or a cadaver dog, alerted to Lacey's scent being in the boat.